This place is a mess. I'm Sean the Shepherd, and this is Adventures in Minecrafting. Don't mind me, I'm just throwing rotten flesh into the sewer system here in our village. And speaking of our village, look at her! Isn't she a beaut? Can you believe this was just an ordinary Minecraft Plains village when we first got here? Now, there's still some remnants of this being a Minecraft Plains village. If you come around here, we've got this old little market square. This is original, complete with a bell. And over here we've got, uh, oh, looks like we've got an original street light. And we've got this original house. I wonder if there's anything still in here. Yeah, we never even pulled the potatoes from the chest. There's even a bed still here, so yes. There's remnants to say this was once a Plains Village. Oh, and here we've got the original butcher over here, still with some pigs in the yard. And we've got this Minecraft church. Let's take a look inside. I don't know if I've ever been in here. I think maybe I went in here to steal the brewing stand. Uh, let's see, we can go up in the tower. Is there anything up in the tower? Well, nothing on this floor. How about up on top? Nope, just a tower. Looks like, oh, it looks like maybe I came up here and put a torch. Uh, great view. Great view of the mansion. Now I've gone back and forth about what I want to do with this church. It's a little too small. It's right in the middle of the village, so we, we can't replace it with a full-size church. My plan is to put a full-size church in that clear, open plains area just beyond the Mason's Lodge. But I don't want to just get rid of this thing. And so I suggested a few episodes back, what if we ruin it? What if we make this a ruin, sort of a monument to the original Minecraft village that was here, and we just sort of tear pieces of it down and break it down and make it look like it was a structure that was once here a long, long time ago, but isn't here anymore. And so it can still stay right here in the center, but it's just a reminder of what this village used to be. Hi, kitty. So the plan for today is to ruin this church. But before we start ruining the church, I wanted to show you something. We've named our puppy. Oh, look at the little happy puppy. Do you want to, want to know we named him? Joush. And who is Joush, you ask? Well, Joush is a great friend of the channel, and he's got his own channel. In fact, I'll link it in the description so you can go over and check him out. And now, let's get back to ruining that church. And how do you ruin a church, you ask? When the offering plate comes by, you could take money out instead of putting money in. You could bring your new puppy to church. Josh, what did you do? Build the church next door out of prettier blocks and prettier music. Spread lots of vicious gossip about the pastor. You could burn it down. But that won't do much good with fire tick off. You could cover it in lava. Or there's always this method. But we're not going to do any of that. And you shouldn't do any of those things either. Although I am tempted to use a little TNT. No, we're just going to transform this little church today into something that looks like it was once here, but now is a memory and a reminder. So let's get to ruining.
And here we are. In fact, I particularly like this view from up on top of the barn here. There's our little ruin. What used to be a church is now a memory of an ancient civilization here in Minecraft. Now I added some smooth stone in because the cobble was just a little too much. It needed to be broken up and I figured over time through weather maybe some of these areas uh, had worn down. Uh, you see we've we've added a custom oak tree here that's grown up and um, if we go in here actually let's go around through the door uh, you'll see we've left the entire structure uh, everything that was once there we've even left a couple glass panes just to say hey you know glass is glass is sturdy glass can glass can last uh, we've got some rubble here where um, things have fallen down actually we have a little bit of dirt collected under there can't have that there we go I like it and if you go inside here you know the grass is all overgrown we've got some some dead trees that haven't been able to find life in here even just a little remnant of that ladder that was in here and I, I did put some light in here and I've hidden light around the outside under some of the bushes over here I believe there's some light do we see it yep there's some light down there and there you have it we have a ruined church right in the middle as a, as a marker for our village. Oh, wait. I have an idea. I'll be right back. So check this out. I thought we already had one tree outside. What if we had a tree growing up inside the chapel? Check it out. I dig it. I dig it. And, and with the addition of those leaves, I removed... Uh, some of the bushes. I didn't remove all the bushes, but I removed some of the bushes out here. Oh, look at that. I like that. I like that. Just sort of a, a scraggly oak tree coming out and over the wall growing up in the middle. Let's come around here, see it from this angle. Oh yeah, look at that. You can see the tree growing up through the holes in the wall coming out over the door. What does it look like inside? Oh yeah. Oh yeah, I dig this. I dig this. And by the way, this is now an excellent parkour map. Uh, let's see if we can get up here, get up here. I think we can come around. Yep, yep, yep. And we're up on top of the trees. Awesome. Awesome. We've got a ruin. Well, hey, that is going to be it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed episode 27 of Adventures in Minecrafting. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Take care.